Hello, my name is Tatiana Lebedeva and I was born and bred in St. Petersburg, Russia. I moved to the UK three years ago to study English as foreign language and this is when I discovered my true passion and love to the theatre. I There are many reasons why I love theatre, but the best of all is that theatre brings us together and also theatre shows us unheard stories or bring awareness or bring important topics through entertaining form. For example, last week I've listened to uh, an audio drama about Jan Karras and then I read an article about that, about that play that during those time when that theatre company showed the performances all around UK in, the, in different schools they, sh they, they told that some young people, they reached to, to this theatre company and they, they said that they had the same problem as people in this play. So this is why I want to become a professional actress. I want to make change, I want to help people, I want to make difference. The projects I am most proud about is the project we did last year with my classmates about Alzheimer's disease and dementia. This project is close to me personally and it was really important for me because also I wrote some scenes and I directed them. It was very interesting response from other students who came to see our show because some people they were crying after the performance and some people they were shocked after what they saw because some of the students they never heard of that disease, they never experienced anything like this or with their relatives. To move further, in my free time <laughs> I like to play tennis, I like run, I like running, I so recently I've started to look, recently I've started to learn how to play piano because of the lockdown, I had so much free time. I have my YouTube channel where I speak in both languages, Russian and English to my followers. Also, I like taking pictures, it's kind of meditation for me because it helps you to concentrate and focus and be grateful for everything around you at that moment. I like traveling, I wish I can travel more and I hope I'll travel more this year. I want to study I want to study at UCLan because I like I like how 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 practical the course is. I saw that there are just three modules and they're very practical, no dissertation. And when I was speaking the university, I it was one of the reasons because I'm writing dissertation this year, so I don't want to write it twice, like this year and next year. Also I like that the course preparing students for professional career and for professional industry um, because I want to step, I want to make the next step after my education, I want to find a job and work in the industry. What I also liked is the accent that put on screen acting. Last week and this week I was taking a part in student project, I was playing a lead role in a short film by students from University of Gloucestershire and I wish I had I, I wish I was prepared for this <laughs> for this more because it was very unusual for me to try hit marks to keep continuity and I needed to learn really quick on set just like that <laughs> but yeah it was very unusual and interesting experience also I have my passion for audio drama and this term I directed and I was playing one part in audio drama written by Jack Thorne. In the future I would definitely love to have more projects and more work in audio drama because I truly enjoy listening to it and I know that there are many people who like to listen to I would like to finish my presentation. Thank you for your time and I hope to speak to you face to face. Have a great day. Speak to you soon, hopefully. <laughs> bye bye. I wouldn't have natural birth if you put guns on my head. Fuck that for a bunch of bananas.
one of the most dangerous, chaotic, stressful things a woman can do. I wouldn't subject my worst enemy to it, let alone somebody I loved, because basically, you're playing Russian roulette. Obstetrics is the most stressful job you can do. I wanted to be a gynecologist, but I couldn't bear the politics. It's a man's world, gynecology. My boyfriend wants to have a child. But after everything I've seen, no chance. I'm not risking it. He can have it himself. I'll hold his hand. To be honest, children annoy me a bit. They're so selfish and distracting. How can you concentrate? I feel a bit sorry for people with children. I see them coming in here with their bags packed, all worried and excited as if they're setting off on some incredible voyage to a strange new world. But they're never coming home. You see me, Lord Basanio, where I stand, such as I am. Though, for myself alone, I wouldn't be ambitious in my wish to wish myself much better. Yet for you, I would be troubled twenty times myself, a thousand times more fat, ten thousand times more rich. That's only to stand high in your account. I might in virtues, beauties, livings, friends, exceed account. But the whole sum of me is sum of something which to term and gross is an unschooled girl, unlessened, unpractised. Happy in this she is not yet so old, but she may learn. <laughs> Happier than this she is not bred so dull, but she can learn. Happiest of all is that her gentle spirit commits itself to yours to be directed, as from her lord, her governor, her king. Myself and what is mine to you and yours is now converted. But now I was the lord of this mansion, master of my servants, queener myself, and even now, but now, this house, these servants, and this same myself are yours, my lord. I give them with this ring, which when you part from, lose or give away, let it presage the ruin of your love and be my vantage to exclaim on you.